Hello love bugs and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Sarah and I help teach people how to find inner happiness through fitness and spirituality. And today, we're going to do another book review and that is Winning the War in Your Mind by Craig Gro Groschel, I think it is, Groschel, Groschel, whatever. Either way, this has been one of the most life-changing books I've literally ever read and I just had to share some of this stuff with you guys. If you can kind of see the tagline right here, it says change your thinking, change your life. This book has seriously changed so much for me in such a short amount of time. And since finishing it just two weeks ago, here are some of the things that have come into fruition in my life. I closed on my first property. I made the most money I've ever made in my life in one month. I have officially become an athlete for a nutritional supplement brand. I received a contract for a movie I'll be acting in. And I closed more deals in the last two days of my day job than I did the entire previous month. And I invested in myself to pivot my life in a new direction. And honestly guys, I did this by changing one small thing, one thing in my mind and it brought me all of this. And it's like, I had to share it. I had to share it with you guys. It's just been so baffling I've just been flying so high and it's just been so beautiful and sure yeah you could say a few of these things were already in motion such as closing on the rental property or you like myself can believe in divine timing simultaneously happening because you're allowing it to because this book teaches you how to unclog your mind and remove the blockages that are preventing you from receiving or even going after the things in your life that you truly, truly desire, the things that you really know will make you happy. Now, even though this book has so many teachings, so many incredible things, I really wanted to share with you guys the one thing that I've personally implemented that allowed me to receive all of these wonderful, beautiful things in my life and my biggest takeaway from this book. And a quick little shout out for Jason D'Amico for getting me this book. If you like stellar talent in the arts, blues, rock community, along with mind-opening podcasts, I will definitely link his YouTube in the description below, so go check him out. So what I'm about to share with you seems so simple. It seems so duh. It seems so easy, but it is certainly a practice. It's certainly something you have to have constant awareness of but as I shared with you already it brings amazing things and it's so worth doing and what that is is replacing every negative thought with a positive one I know sounds easy sounds simple well I'm here to tell you it's easier said than done I don't even think we realize half the time when we have negative thoughts flowing through us because it's so easy for that to happen and so easy for us to kind of overlook it and not pay attention to what those thoughts are. And really, what the trick is, is you have to catch yourself in the moment, on the spot, and boom, replace that negative thought with a positive one immediately. And when I say every negative thought, I mean as many as you possibly can, as many that you catch, and you have to do your best to truly believe that positive thought. But even if you don't, that's okay. This is equally about creating a new habit as much as it is, is actually thinking the new thoughts and replacing the negative thoughts with the positive one. Ugh, I really don't wanna drive this far for an appointment where I know I'm probably not gonna get the deal. Replaced with, wow, it's such a beautiful day out to be driving. Or, ugh, I wish my abs were showing more. Replaced with, wow, my abs are popping out more than they were a year ago. Or, man, I really don't wanna do chores today. 
replaced with. Wow, I am so lucky to live in this beautiful home and I know I will be at more peace and I will be happier once it's clean. It could literally be anything, guys. Just let your mind run wild. <laughs> and make sure you do hit that like button and subscribe. If you want a more positive and happy life, you have to create it. You have to be the one to do it. You have to create the habit. You have to have the awareness in yourself, in your mind, in your thoughts, in your surroundings. No one else is gonna do it for you. Something else that Craig mentions very often in this book is a lie that is believed to be true will affect your life as if it were true. And that really relates back to everything I've been talking about in this video. Think about it. Your thoughts create your beliefs. So if you think something repeatedly, I'm so fat, I'm so unhappy in life, I'm so broke, I'm never gonna have money. You are literally conditioning your mind for those things to be true. Then you begin or continue living your life as if those things were true. And then, snowballs and snowballs and snowballs. Let's use the I'm so fat or I need to lose weight example. If you got dressed this morning, looked in the mirror and thought, I'm so fat, I need to lose weight. One, you're not alone. I think like 90% of us do that. <laughs> then you go to work and one of your coworkers brings in a cake for someone's birthday. Your initial thought is most likely something like, I shouldn't eat that, I'm trying to lose 10 pounds. But that quickly shifts to, well, I'm fat anyway, what's one more slice of cake? And before you know it, that happens 10 times, 20 times, 50 times, and then you are heavier than you were when you started. Alternatively, if you replace, I'm so fat, or I need to lose 10 pounds with, I am improving my weight and losing a little bit every single day. Your thought patterns begin to shift. You begin to believe that is what's true. Then your actions align with your thoughts and you end up turning down that slice of cake. And then turning down unhealthy foods becomes your habit. And before you know it, boom, Boom, 10 pounds, gone. Our minds are the most powerful things that we have. We don't even realize it. And the thing is, is anything that you think, the thoughts that you have manifest into your reality, into your real physical world. If you're unhappy about something, change your thoughts about it. And I guarantee, I guarantee, 100% money back guaranteed, your life will change. Thank you guys so much for spending time with me. I really enjoyed this book. I highly recommend it if you're looking to change your thought patterns, create a better life for yourself. And it is very faith-based. It has a lot of scripture in it. So if you are a uh, believer in God, then this is definitely the book for you. I love you guys so much. You have the power to change your thoughts. You have the power to change your life and I believe in you and that you can do it. It's just time that you change your mindset and change your thoughts so that you believe you can do it too. I love you guys and until next week, don't forget, be limitlessly yourself.